Hey, what's up? I'm Jesse Brune. I'm gonna show you a super simple recipe by Deb Perlman of smittenkitchen.com. My $10 meal for four is a pizza margarita, homemade pizza. Who doesn't like that? It doesn't matter how good your pizza place is, and here in New York City, we have a lot of really great pizza places. Nobody makes it exactly the way you want it every single time. The first step in Deb's amazing pizza recipe is making the pizza dough yourself. I know it sounds terrifying, but it's not that scary, I promise. We start off with some yeast. Put that into a bowl. You're gonna put a little warm water in with the yeast, okay? You're gonna add a little bit of sugar here, and you're just going to gently mix it, just like that. Now you're gonna let this sit for about 10 minutes. And as you can see, a little, it looks very cloudy and murky in the bowl. That means that the yeast is doing its thing and we're ready to rock. So I'm gonna add the salt to it and I'm going to slowly incorporate the flour. Now it comes the fun part. You get to start really using your hands. Don't be afraid. You really can't be uh, a scaredy cat when it comes to dough. We're just gonna start kneading it. This dough here looks pretty great. Now what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take our olive oil, just rub it on the pizza dough, and kinda get it nice and coated. And we just fold it under, fold it under. So you're kind of making a little bit of a ball shape here. We're just gonna top it with a little plastic wrap, put it in the corner, set it off to the side, let it sit, it's gonna sit for about an hour. For the sauce, I don't even bother with jarred sauce. I prefer to just sort of take simple strained or pureed tomatoes, add a little bit of chopped garlic, pinch of red pepper flakes, salt, pepper, and whatever you like to jazz it up with. Just keep it really simple. Now I'm not gonna put too much sauce on. Again, we don't wanna get this, we don't wanna get the dough soggy and we don't wanna weigh it down. Now let's get some toppings on there. Look how gorgeous these leaves look right here on this dough. It's gonna look so pretty when we're done. Let's put this in the oven. 400 degrees, about 10 minutes. Deb, you must be some kind of pizza genius because this is a gorgeous, gorgeous creation here. Look at that, it's just absolutely perfect. Take it and just cut right into it. Don't be afraid to get aggressive with your cutting. When you tell people that you're really good at making homemade pizza, they're gonna be impressed. They're gonna be a little jealous too, and they should be, it's awesome. Serve this with a nice salad and you got dinner for four people. So give this a try, let us know what you think. Get more recipes from Deb along with other top food bloggers at goodbite.com.